I am Anil Kumar sharing with you an application question based on quadratic equations. Peter wants to build five identical pens side by side on his farm using 40 meters of fencing. Determine the dimensions of the enclosures that would give the largest possible area. Calculate this area. So let's sketch it first. Okay. So let's say one two, three, four, and one, five. Let us say their width is uh, W. So you see, they, that is their width of each. And the length will keep L, right? So L is this much. Since we know that the fencing is 30 meters, that is the perimeter, right? So 30 meters should be equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 W plus twice length. So that is how two variables length and width are related. Now we could divide by 2. So we get 15 equals to 3 W plus L or rearrange. So we say L equals to 15. I mean L equals to yes 15 minus 3 W. So we know what is L in relation to width. Now we want to maximize area. So what is area? Area of the whole thing will be length into width. So we'll write area as length times width. Since we know length is all this in terms of width, we can write 15 minus 3W times W. Now we want to find the dimensions and also the maximum area. So, so the best way could be to do completing the squares. So basically, if you open this, we get 15w minus 3w square. So let's do completing the squares from here and uh, figure out both the things. That is width. Once we get the width, we know the length and also the area. So we know area is equal to, let me rewrite this as 3w square plus 15w, we can take minus 3 common, so we get w square minus 5w. To complete the square, we'll do half of this, correct? So we get w square minus 5w plus 2.5 square minus 2.5 square, correct? So add and subtract 2.5, that should give you minus 3 times, let me put square brackets. First three terms give you a perfect square, negative sign, 2.5 whole square, and 2.5 whole square is 6.25, but let's use calculator. 2.5 whole square is in decimals, 6.25, so we'll write negative 6.25. Now we can open the brackets, we get minus 3 times W minus 2.5 whole square plus we'll multiply this by by 3 negative negative becomes positive 18.75 so once you have vertex form parabola opening downwards kind of like this and we know this point is is at 3 18.75 is it okay so that gives you the answer perfect so from here, we know one thing, which is maximum area, the whole area, will be equals to 18.75 meter square. Width is equals to 2.5 meters. Length is equal to 15 minus 3 times 2.5. And that is 15 minus... 15 7.5 so it is 7.5 meters correct so so that's what you get <clears throat> so we get our answer as uh, dimensions you can say uh, will be dimensions will be uh, 2.5 meters by 7.5 meters correct and maximum area will be 18.75 meter square. So I hope uh, all the steps are absolutely clear. Feel free to make your suggestions. 
and uh, do some more practice questions on quadratic applications. I'll provide you with links. Thank you and all the best.